don't be swayed by massive praise and don't be swayed by brickbats. Treat both of those exactly the same. You have to be tough, that's all. You've got to be tough. And uh, because, yes, a lot of it's rejection, then you get accepted, then you get rejected. Wherever you are on the blooming ladder, unless you're Meryl Streep. You need luck, you need, um, you need the breaks, you need support. Learn your lines, be professional, give it your best shot every time. Um, work with an agent that you believe in and that believes in you that you can have an open dialogue with. Be proactive, just be proactive and not to worry about it. It will come, it will come, people will work. So you just gotta, you know, bide your time sometimes. And if you're lucky to work straight away, then fantastic. And, but again, to keep grounded and just enjoy it. Always keep learning and don't think, and you get to a certain level, you think, I think I know it all. No, none of us know it all. I mean, I, I started singing lessons three years ago. Look at me. I mean, you know, you still keep learning. That's what I would say. Well, most of my career has been on stage and I'm learning all the time, you know, on stage and on screen. Um, and, you know, I'm 61 and I'm only now, really only now starting to feel a little bit more confident in front of, in front of a camera. I do feel that drama schools need to do a bit more on screen acting uh, because, you know, look how many products there are now on channels all over the place. So, I mean, a lot more young actors are leaving a theatre training and been given 500 self-tapes to do. That's not easy. I would say for the theatre, you, you build up that equipment around your diaphragm to be able to, to speak in a way that you're not shouting. People at the back can hear you. And then you kind of bring it all down, the film and TV, because you've only got that looking at you. You're always, always, always learning. And listening, listening, listening to uh, how a see, uh, shot's being set up, um, focusing on other people, you know, it's not just about you. Just remember that you're lucky enough to probably be following a dream that you had since you were eight or nine years old, so enjoy it a little bit, you know, it's, it's not always the be all and end all if you don't get a job, it's about, you know, the continuation of the career and if you believe in yourself and you have the talent, you'll eventually get there.